Good morning everyone and welcome to Panama. We are actually here on a trip for my birthday so I thought I might do a little vlog and just share with you guys a little bit of the hotel that we're staying at. We're not doing a lot of activities just because we wanted to do something very chill but mainly it's just gonna be a lot of like outfit inspiration for you guys to have in case you're planning any tropical or beach vacation coming up. So we just literally landed, we checked into our hotel room and we're gonna go grab something to eat and then try to enjoy the day as best as we can because it is a little bit gloomy and the forecast does say that it will be raining later on. So we wanna be able to take advantage of the pool as much as we can right now. We are currently back in the room now I'm sorry about the lighting here I try my best to get a little bit of light just for this it's just that it's really gloomy outside so there's not a lot of sunlight coming in but I just wanted to share really quick a recap of the day we just basically hung out in the hotel I have to say I'm super impressed with one everything about the hotel the restaurants the food is so delicious and two the people in the hotel are just the sweetest they're so friendly and they're willing to help whenever they can now the plan for this trip is just basically to hang out in the hotel and we do have plans to go see the Panama Canal tomorrow but tonight we're actually gonna get ready and go into town for dinner and I'm super excited so that leads me into this portion of the video which is in collaboration with Ana Luisa now if you are new around here Ana Luisa is a jewelry brand which I have worked with many times before and I absolutely love all their pieces they have really become one of my go-to jewelry brands to shop from i love how they have such dainty everyday pieces that you can wear on the daily but then they also come out with specific collections that you can incorporate for a specific event and i really like that as well now Ana luisa's main mission is about sustainability and they want to offer basically high quality pieces at affordable prices and not only that but all of their pieces are also nickel free so if you are allergic that's something that you don't have to worry about now they have been kind enough to give me a coupon code for you guys and that is for a 10% off discount. Now do keep in mind that this discount cannot be stacked with any current promotion that they might be running on the website, but I'll make sure to link the coupon code on the description box and put it right here for you guys in case you're interested in shopping. I don't make any money out of this. This is just a discount code that they have given me in order to give to my viewers. So before I get into my night outfit, I just wanted to share with you really quick a few pieces that I picked up from them. It was actually my birthday yesterday and they were very, very nice enough to send me over some pieces. Now I wanna start off with this ring, which I am obsessing over. You guys know I love a good pearl, whether it's an earring or a nice necklace. And as soon as I saw this dainty little pearl ring, I loved it but since I was coming to Panama for my birthday I wanted to add a little something special and they literally like weeks before I headed out came out with a new collection that I absolutely fell in love with each piece has its own name so I'll make sure to leave everything linked down below for you guys but the pieces do come also in these little beautiful packages and I've shared before that I love bringing these to travel now I literally just put everything into one and brought it on this trip but I'm so excited to share with you guys and this particular collection was perfect for my Panama trip just because it has this like bamboo kind of style to it and I just felt like it was so so cute especially for the beach now I went ahead and added all three pieces that they offered for this collection. I wanted to have the option to play around with it and mix and match either the cuff with the ring and then a cute pair of accent earrings. So I did pick up the ring. They do have this 
beautiful little cuff as well that has that whole bamboo look all throughout so that's really really pretty and dainty so of course i want to thank Ana luisa for not only collaborating with me in this portion of the video but also for sending me these beautiful pieces for my birthday in order to enjoy it while i'm here in panama all right guys so this is the outfit for tonight i'm so excited to finally be wearing this skirt I do have a reel over on Instagram where I shared with you the pieces that I picked up from Target with Tabitha Brown and this is one of them and I was just waiting for this event specifically to wear it. I did just pair it with a basic white bodysuit and then I'm also wearing this super cute little PVC bag from Amazon. Everything that I wear will be linked down below whether it's the same pieces or similar. I always try to do these in my what I wear videos. And then I did go with some Zara flats. I initially wanted to do a little bit of a block heel, but we're gonna be walking a little bit and I really wanna be comfortable. And then I opted for some of the Ana Luisa pieces. This is the cuff. And then I paired it with the ring. And then I just went with some little accent earrings that I get from this little clay shop that I follow on Instagram. So this is my second birthday dinner look and I'm very excited about how it turned out. Good morning everyone. It's actually our second day here in Panama today and we just got ready to head out. We have a tour for the Panama Canal. I'm excited to go and see it in action and hopefully learn a little bit more about it. But about last night, I cannot say enough great things about that restaurant, you guys. It's called Santa Rita and the owner is actually from Spain and his wife is Argentinian. So they have this mix of like a Spaniard and Argentinian kind of fusion within the food and the restaurant and everything was so delicious the staff was so friendly we really had such a great time i'll make sure to pop up pictures of the food or videos if i got anything like that i wanted to really just enjoy the moment with my husband of course so i didn't vlog as much as i normally probably would however this morning we're actually heading down to the hotel we do have the breakfast included in our stay which i think was a great idea just because since we actually want to enjoy the hotel we didn't want to have to be going out taking an uber grabbing breakfast and then coming back to the hotel and today since we did have our tour planned we also didn't want to spend too much time looking for a place to eat so i'm going to show you really quick what i'm wearing which is very simple and then we're going to head on over to grab breakfast so here's what i'm wearing i'm going with that white linen top that you guys know i love i definitely think i have to add a few more colors for the summer because this white one has gotten so much wear and then I just went with some basic jean shorts just because they're very comfortable. And I was going to wear sneakers, but I opted for my Valentino Jelly Rockstar sandals. These sandals are so, so comfortable, you guys. I really like wearing them anytime we go anywhere because I just feel like not only do they make my outfit a little bit more girly, but they're just really comfortable to wear in general. And then really quick, I did wanna share with you the bag that I'm taking because I'm not gonna take the beach bag that I've been carrying to the pool. I actually brought a long chump, which was super easy to pack. All right, so here we have the bag that I'm taking today. Now, this long chump here is a limited edition piece that I got back in 2016 in Paris. It's just the same layer out as a regular long chomp and then i'll just show you what i have inside i have my toiletry 19 which has all my stuff that i carry on the daily a bottle of water sunglasses my husband's cap and then some wipes and a portable charger and my wallet is right here in the back so that is the one that i'm taking out today because like i said i just feel it's such a carefree bag and it's really easy to just have in case it starts raining
Hey guys, so we just had breakfast <laughs> that was really trying to escape the camera. So we just wanted to walk around a little bit the hotel. We went to the pool area. We're actually here during their winter months. So even though it's kind of sunny, most of the times it's gloomy with a little bit of breeze, but it's still really nice just to be here. And then we were just walking around the lobby area. You actually have to get to the lobby to then transfer elevators because they also have residences in this building. So now we're gonna head on down to catch an Uber and head over to the Panama Canal. I have to tell you that the breakfast was absolutely delicious as well. We did do the buffet because that's what's included with our stay that we chose to add. But they also have an a la carte menu which you can pick from. We actually ate from that yesterday and that was also really good. Hey guys, so we are actually back at the hotel now. I tried to film at the Panama Canal while we were there, but it was really, really windy. And even though I tried to get a new little mic for my phone, it didn't help very much. So unfortunately I couldn't film while we were there. But just wanted to share with you guys that we had actually done reservations online, which they recommended you to, and we had them for 11. Once we got there, I think we had missed a boat going by for like a couple of hours before. And unfortunately, the next one wasn't going to pass until like 3.30. So we weren't going to wait around for hours and something so we decided just to still go around and then see the museum and just go to the viewing point which was super impressive so while we were there they were just basically giving some facts about the Panama Canal and it was just really nice to be able to see the place itself you hear about it but once you're there and you actually see it it's completely different I just wanted to basically let you guys know that if you are planning to do a trip to Panama just keep in mind that it's not guaranteed that while you're there you're going to be able to see a boat crossing so unfortunately we missed that but who knows we might be back at some point point. and then afterwards we headed back to the hotel and in front of our hotel there's actually this super cute mobile coffee shop which I wanted to stop in obviously as the coffee lover that I am and it was really cute they have a couple of things in the menu is more like treats and coffee drinks they do have a few like lunch items but nothing too too crazy we actually just finished having lunch and the sun has come out and i was so excited so right now we're just laying out by the pool and enjoying the day at night we're gonna be going to the restaurant in the hotel so today is just gonna be a relaxed day for the rest of the time All right guys, so we just got ready to go out to dinner. We actually spent the rest of the afternoon just hanging out by the pool and it was really relaxing. We even knocked out for a few, so it was the perfect way to spend the Saturday. So really quick, I just wanted to share with you the outfit for tonight. I'm sorry about the lighting, but this is like the best place that I could find in the room. The rest of the room is pretty dim, so this is the only spot that we have in order to be able to share with you what I'm wearing. This is a little skirt from Express. I love it. I love the color as well. And then I paired it with this top, which is also from Express. These two pieces were like on their clearance section. So I'll try to find them and link them down below for you if I can. I'm going with my Louis Vuitton as a little clutch. We don't have to carry so much. We are going to dinner at the restaurant in the hotel. So I just packed the bare essentials in here. And then I am wearing this cute little twilly from Silk Philosophy. It is like an Instagram page, so I'll make sure to link them down below for you guys in case you're interested. I'm going with my Zara sandals. And then I am wearing my pieces from Ana Luisa. I did put the bangle. The only thing that I did this time around is I put the open side up, and I really like how this looks. And then I paired it with the ring and the earrings. Since I am wearing the twilly and the Louis Vuitton clutch, I didn't want to go with too much of a statement earring. So I felt like by having these little dainty pieces, the outfit was fully complete.
Good morning guys and today is actually our third day in Panama. We're hanging out by the pool at the moment. We went to have breakfast early in the morning. The plan today is actually to have a little bit of breakfast. We want to relax for a little bit and then go work out and most likely we're probably gonna go into town we had plans to go tomorrow but as we're hanging out by the pool right now we've realized that the pool is pretty busy so we might as well just hang out and check out the city center of Panama City now I did want to let you guys know that yesterday's dinner was so delicious we actually stayed in the hotel as I mentioned and what we did was just have dinner at the restaurant here so overall it's been an amazing stay so far once we get dressed to head out into the city center I'll share with you guys my outfit all right so there's been a change of plans we're actually gonna head on out to the city first because we are still kind of full from breakfast so we wanted to make sure that we enjoyed the day as much as we can all right so i wanted to share with you guys what i was wearing and i don't know what happened to the mic but even at the highest volume setting you still won't be able to hear me so this is the outfit that I went with. I wanted to wear something light because it's really warm outside. So I'm wearing this linen H&M shirt and then I paired it with some linen pants from Old Navy. I wore my Valentino jellies, which I had not stopped wearing throughout the whole trip. They're just so comfortable. And then this is a PVC bag that I bought from Amazon specifically for this trip because I wanted something that I could use crossbody but that it wouldn't be too bulky as well. And then these Key Australia sunglasses are super cute. They have that mirror effect and then they're very oversized. And last but not least, I added a cute accessory from Silk Philosophy. I just wanted to share really quick with you guys what I did to make this bag look a little bit shorter on me crossbody because if I leave it as is it is a little bit longer so I got the chain I put it inside and then I got a hair tie and got a little bit of a piece and tied it up like this hopefully that makes sense but I have seen people do that a lot for their Chanel walks so I kind of used the same mechanism for this one and it hits me right at like my waistline which is right where I like for it to hit me crossbody personally. So just a little tip. Hello guys, so we are actually walking now Casco Viejo and I just wanted to share really quick because I love finding little places where I can buy unique pieces from so I got this little dainty pearl necklace it's just so cute she does say I can get in the beach and the pool with it which was perfect because I just wanted something like that to wear whenever I'm going like in the water and I don't want to have to have like a regular necklace on and then I also got some earrings for my mom and my mother-in-law I always love taking back something for them if they're not here with me just as a little piece of memory and then obviously I got one for myself too so I'll make sure to share with you a little later as of now, we're probably just gonna keep walking around. It's actually really nice because there's a breeze coming in. Where we were at before it was really warm. There's no linen shirt or linen pants that can help you in this Panama heat. It's actually humid, so. But besides that, it's been really nice just walking around the city center. So I highly recommend you come and just at least spend a couple of hours walking around here. All right, so I wanted to get on here because I wanted to share with you guys, you know, I love coffee, but Rudy's always saying that I'm not a real coffee lover because I just like my lattes with like my flavors and all that. So he was actually doing some research and found out that 
Panama has like a native bean to them and is it called geisha? Geisha, bean? I, think, I think you pronounce it geisha. But it's the bean is geisha or the coffee? I don't know if it's geisha. Well, it's, that's the name pretty much of it. And we stumbled upon this super cute little coffee shop. So I wanted to go in and grab a nice coffee and he wanted to try the geisha coffee. And what were your thoughts? Never again. <laughs> I had a little bit and it is definitely an acquired taste. It's very strong, but I feel like it had, yes, like a fruity kind of taste to it. I don't know. Once again, I don't mind giving it a shot because it's always nice to try things. That's the only way that you can really have an opinion about something. But as a coffee quote unquote lover that I call myself, I'll stick with my flavored lattes. Hey guys, so I just finished getting ready for dinner and I am not in the best mood. I had the cutest outfit planned and I don't know how my shorts got something on them and I cannot take it off. I think there was like Clorox by the sink area and I was leaning on it to put on my makeup and then when I backed up to see my full outfit, it was like pink. I'll insert a clip here. So I was just so sad because I had this really cute outfit planned for our last night. I know, first world problems, but I just wanted to share. Regardless of the fact, what I did was that I changed. Thankfully, I had brought other clothes just in case I didn't feel like wearing what I had planned throughout the trip. I don't know if this happens to you, but sometimes I have something in mind and then when I try it on, it just really doesn't look how I want it to. So as of now, we're just getting ready to go out to dinner for our last night. We decided to go out into a new restaurant that we found online. We had such a great time at the restaurant that we visited on Friday that we wanted to give another place a shot here as well. So that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna get Rudy to record me now and show you the outfit that I'm wearing and then I'll show you a little bit of dinner. Also really quick, how beautiful is this view behind me i'm actually standing at the balcony of our hotel and the view is absolutely stunning it has been pretty gloomy most of the time it was really sunny this morning but then we had like a huge thunderstorm and then now it's just kind of gloomy but at the same time it's nice it's very humid so it's actually nice when you get a little bit of a breeze come in and that's exactly what the weather feels like right now all right so this is the backup look you have seen this one before if you saw my vlog from florence italy i bought this one actually over there and i love this dress it is like a linen material so it's really lightweight so it's very flowy and it's perfect especially after all the food we've eaten in this trip and then i went back to my azara sandals I have mentioned that these need to be broken in but once you've worn them a couple of times they're super super comfortable and then I opted to wear these little statement earrings from a little clay shop that I follow on Instagram but I went back to pairing it with those key pieces from Ana Luisa. I felt like they were perfect, especially for the Panama trip. And then for my purse, I am carrying my Louis Vuitton clutch again. It is the toiletry 19, but I carry it as a clutch and it's perfect because it fits everything that I need. Good morning everyone. Today I definitely woke up in a way better mood. I'm sorry about the rant yesterday but I was so excited for my outfit and I was just really bummed out that 
I couldn't wear what I had planned for my last night. However, today is a new day and we just went downstairs and grabbed breakfast really quick, but we came back upstairs and started picking up everything. We're actually heading back home today, but we do have a late flight. So there's actually a shopping mall called Multiplazas and we're gonna head on over now because it was raining in the morning, so it's kind of gloomy. Actually, last night we were on the Uber um, with a very nice gentleman and he was telling us how it rains nine months out of the year in Panama which blew my mind <laughs> because I feel like they have so many nice beaches that you can visit and, and this hotel in particular is also really nice to just enjoy on a really sunny day and the fact that you have so much rain it's kind of like wow but overall it's been a beautiful city the people are absolutely amazing now i also wanted to give a huge thanks again to ana luisa for part collaborating with me in this video i hope you guys enjoyed how i put the pieces that i picked out for my birthday together with these summer looks but as i said make sure to check out their website because they have pieces for any type of occasion and really good everyday dainty jewelry to wear as well today i actually opted to put away the little bamboo set and i'm just wearing the dainty pearl ring that I mentioned to you guys that I also got so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog it was just kind of a very chill style vlog showing you a little bit around the city but mostly focusing on outfit ideas and inspiration in case you do have a summer vacation coming up now if you do enjoy this kind of styling outfit inspiration videos I will link my most recent video up here for you guys and it is a ton of outfit ideas for summer on how to style white sneakers I had an awesome time filming that video for you guys so I'm sure you'll enjoy it as well as always thank you so much for taking some time out of your day to watch today and I hope to catch you all in my next one bye everyone